Uh, what I have here is pili pili. I have fondue, chicken in sauce for stew. It's also not soup. <laughs> of course, your water, but you will get thirsty. This is bija. And of course, you need your bowl of water. The water is to help your hands when it gets sticky with the tofu to kind of wash it off and then eat again. So let's begin. Okay, guys, I'm going to just show you how to eat fufu. If your hands are already wet, go ahead and just start. But if you need to kind of moisten your hands, go ahead and dip it in water, like so. And you're going to break into the pizza. Okay, you're going to fold it like this. And then you're going to dip it into your veggie or sauce, whichever you prefer. Let me go ahead and start with the veggie. And like so, you are ready to eat. Some, some people chew their poo, poo some people swallow. Unless it's meat, a lot of Africans just swallow fufu. It does not have a taste, but there are different types of fufu that do have taste. This one does not really, or doesn't. Of course, you would not be African if you did not have some spice into your life, okay? Some people do a lot hotter than this, but you can do whatever you want. Now, hot sauce. Would this go with hot sauce? I would say no. Because hot sauce just does not sit right with African foods. But you can give it a try and let me know how it goes. So I'm going to go ahead and start again. Don't worry, your bowl is going to get dirty. That's the point of it. It's just to help you get the sticky thing, the bija or fufu, off your hands. Some people do that, but if you're on one on Boca, you know how to do this. <laughs> and then it's ready. Again, you can cut a piece off of what you just made. Dip Mommy, it in the sauce. And this is also ready to be eaten. So if you are doing the Fufu Challenge, I would highly recommend if you're doing searching you've come to the right place to watch this before you do the fufu challenge if you guys would like a recipe although it's not a recipe channel i get it you guys see us eat this often let us know and we'll do our best to get it to you again you dip when you feel like uh -uh, my hands are just way too sticky and messy So it's nothing to it. And just if you are ready to do the challenge and you have this bowl out, I'll know you have some African friends that could help you out. <laughs> some people eat fufu with a fork. I call that the bougie class. <laughs> My dad used to eat fufu with a fork. Uh, so obviously I'm not just making fun of everybody i'm just poking fun having fun of me Thanks. 
Big Daddy Bear. <laughs> no, don't show your mouth. What are you doing? You want more? They have been hidden. That one, not that one. <laughs> Chicken. You want some chicken? Should I give you a piece of chicken? It's dirty. It's dirty? No. It's mm -hmm. It's all food. What's that? It's food like this. You want my pudding? You want some more? Ten, ten, huh? Hello. It's yummy. Thank you for watching How to Eat Foo Foo the right way. And with that, dear friends, keep, keep looking, looking up. up. Bye.